channel welcome to my channel if you are new welcome if you are welcome my name is tahana i am back with another video and you're about to tell you are you know that today's video is a vlog first of all i look crazy as hell because i literally just ran out the house i'm trying to go pick up this outfit from this girl so i can hurry up and get dressed and then go to the barbecue slash picnic it's currently like 11 o'clock in the morning the barbecue is supposed to start at two o'clock so i really don't got a lot of time I also got to stop at the store and grab some stuff, so I'm trying to hurry up, and I'm trying to get dressed, my makeup, all that, curl my hair, shower, do all that, so I'm kind of on a late show. But y'all, I'm going to come back to y'all. I'm thinking about stepping out tonight and going to R&B Tuesdays. I'm not sure, but I'm going to come back to y'all once I got the outfits because I need to use my GPS because I don't know where I'm at. Okay, y'all, so I did get the outfits. I'm gonna show y'all once I get home. Well, I'm gonna put a picture on the side. It's like a little bodycon type dress with like the actual body print. And then I got this real bad shirt, the Carisha real bad across the front. I think I'm gonna wear that with some black shorts with my Rick Owens today. I don't know, it's 85 degrees, I'm hot as hell. I'm not that hot cause I'm not like face sweating, but it's hot like, you know. I also need to go to this Dollar Tree, but I really wanna go back home and go to Dollar Tree once I'm dressed, heading towards the barbecue. I think I'm gonna do that instead. I don't know, y'all. I'm thinking to just go now, since I'm right here. Like, why not? So, y'all, I did write like a little miniature list on the stuff that I need. So, I'm gonna try to hurry up and get in and out. I should have grabbed a damn cart. Bitch, I'm outside of some movie. Blue cheese. I swear I'm addicted to the blue cheese. I gotta stick to this paper like blue sleep. Bitch, I'm about my chicken like it's a two piece. You can have your bitch back. She a groupie. She just swallow all my kids in a two seat. Swagged out. Familiar, we bringing them gas out. I still got some back stuffed in the trap house. Off the 42, I'm blowing her back out. I'm back out. Bullshit. Spin back with a full clip. They say I'm with a full clip. Yo, when I say waste of my fucking time, waste of my time, they didn't have. None of the stuff I needed, literally, they didn't have no Q-tips, they didn't have no feminine wipes. None of the stuff that I needed, but they did have the little um, poster board with the markers. I wanted to do like a summer board. Basically, write down stuff that I want to do and achieve over the summer. Boxing, taking myself out to eat, picnic, you know, different stuff. That's the only shit that they had. So I figured they're going to have that everywhere, every Dollar Tree. So I might as well just wait till I get everything at one time, which I knew I should have. But sometimes we just stop here since I'm right here. And I thought they would have had at least something. Y'all know how the white people stores always have shit. Or, you know, you go out a little further and you got more shit than the ones in the hood. They didn't have shit. So I'm finna go home, get myself together, and then try again. I'm gonna come back to y'all once I'm dressed. Because I look a mess. So, y'all, I did my hair and my makeup. Quick beat. I got in the shower, got dressed. I'm gonna give y'all a little quick outfit of the day. Um, I tried to do my makeup a little different. I did end up putting on the sweat proof primer. I don't really know if it's giving or if it's working. I really don't know how to feel about it, but it is what it is. I already did my makeup. It's time to leave out the door. It's finna be two o'clock. It's 1.50. I'm lucky over it. And I just put this wig on yesterday, like literally. I don't know, y'all. It's just like blonde hair is totally different from black hair. Like, it's not bad, but it's more like thicker. You get what I'm saying? Like, it's not... I'm not going to say it's not processed, but it's like... Y'all know what I'm trying to say. If you know, you know. But I'm going to give y'all a little quick outfit of the day. I think I put on too much contour. But it is what it is. I got to leave out the door. I can't really do too much of nothing. Okay, y'all. So, this is the outfit of the day. I didn't record this little part like two, three times because I was not feeling it. But I need to honestly get out of that shit like get groovy like it is what it is sis. but i did curl my hair to my makeup i got on this real bad shirt that i just bought from this girl it was ten dollars and i got on these black shorts that i got from sheen they do got some room i really like these then to top it off i'm wearing my rick owens with this purse that i got from sheen as well real cute real simple i might take some pictures i don't know i don't know i kind of want to put some glasses on top of my head or something let me see what it's giving I don't know. I kind of like the glasses. But I don't want it to look like I got too much going on. So I think I'm going to take the glasses off. Or I might just take them with me. I don't know. But I'm going to leave out the door for real. I got to stop at $15 and grab some chips and some juice for the barbecue. So I really need to be walking out the door now. And I think I'm going to leave the glasses on. I feel like the glasses kind of throwing off the curls. Because the curls ain't already all that good. 
I don't know, but it's a look, it's a look, it's a look. Y'all, it's so fucking hot outside. I'm trying to talk loud so that y'all couldn't hear me because I got all four of my windows down. But the weather is gonna drop in a minute, so that is a plus. But it's hot as hell. Like, humid hot. I really shouldn't even do no makeup. But shout out to Elf Primer because the makeup ain't moved. It is giving. Cause yeah, I don't know, I don't know. My cousin did just call me and asked me was I going up to the barbecue. I think he bringing Chrissy with him. I'm not sure, but I'm gonna just vlog for y'all vlog. Not only that y'all, it is last minute. It's not like a big ass family barbecue. It's really just like my immediate family and friends type shit. I should have run me up a blunt, bro. I'm so fucking dumb. I wasn't gonna find out and grab some stuff. Mama told me that I didn't have to grab it no more unless I wanted to and I really didn't. Cause I am running behind anyways. But I should have run me up a fucking blunt for the ride. Or at least the smoke was like, you know. so many killings and accidents it's ridiculous but i'm gonna go home i wasn't gonna go to dollar tree and get my stuff for the board but i'm gonna go tomorrow once i leave the graveyard so that i could you know have something to do tomorrow before i start door dashing i might not do dash tomorrow because i gotta go pick up some money for my dad i got a lot of shit to do now that i'm thinking about it well not a lot of shit to do but the time framing is not gonna be right because he don't get off work until five i think i'm gonna go to dollar tree and go get the board and stuff go get my bathroom set do my bathroom, go back home, then go to his house, come back, and then do the board with y'all before I close out this vlog. It's most likely the plan. I did get some pictures as well. I really don't like them, so I think I'm gonna delete them because I did post them, but I don't know. I'm gonna put them in here somewhere. I'm kinda skeptical. I took a couple and I feel like I should have posted the ones that I didn't post instead. Grand rising, grand rising, grand rising, y'all. It is the next day. Did get up, get myself together a little bit. I did not get dressed, but I did get up, wash my face, drink my teeth, and stuff like that. I am in the process of rolling me a morning blunt. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning. I'm feeling good, feeling rejuvenated, ready to start my day, feeling energized. First thing first, when I get dressed, I'm gonna go to the graveyard, chill up there for a little bit, you know, talk, chill. And then I'm going to go to Foreman Mills and go pick out my bathroom set, a couple house decorations, take y'all with me. I will be vlogging. Then after that, I'm going to Dollar Tree and I'm going to go and get the stuff that I need for for my summer board. As I was telling y'all yesterday that I want to make a summer board, you know, little stuff that I want to do. But anywho, y'all, I'm not going to lie. My birthday vibe was cute. Like, I'm just wasn't feeling it no more. But at the end of the day, I am thankful and grateful for another year around the sun. Even if my plans don't go as planned. Because, as I mentioned, everything is last minute. I made a post asking who want to come with me. But everybody is, you know, saying they wish they had more time, more time to save. Or they got work they can't take off. It's just not a good time. Like, it's too soon. Which I truly understand because it's basically like two weeks before we leave. And I really didn't think that this was going to happen. But if it comes down to it and I do cancel my flight and don't go, 
end up going somewhere else during the summer i'm gonna just use that money that i was going to use for the trip and just finish decking out my house because honestly like why not i still need to get that done and not only that i'm working towards a new car so everything should be really in my hands like in the palm of my hands like i said i was gonna do it it's done by the middle of june going into july no later than august honestly truthfully get about enrolling into school so i'm trying to wait until the next semester come around and that's one of my main main goals is to enroll into school get something under my belt start working on my credit just doing shit for me i'm 21 finna be 22 and i'm only getting older and i need a lot of shit accomplished by the time i hit 25 honestly one of my subscribers was telling me like credit is king and i truly understand that like you can't really do too much of shit if you don't got no credit honestly you can have all this money but at the end of the day you're gonna need something in your name that belongs to you you get what i'm saying also me and chrissy plan to do a hot box video saturday i think i'm gonna record a hot box tomorrow like a regular hot box and then one with her because i have not been posting on my smoky channel i need to drop some content over there for y'all or at least have some content lined up but y'all as i mentioned i am having a girls night so i'm gonna start going to go get the stuff for the girls night and ordering the stuff next week like early next week because i'm having it next weekend I'm going to order my table this week for sure because I don't want no ifs, ands, or buts, no last minute, no different delivery dates, none of that shit. And I'm honestly excited. I did not plan to go out to the club because, as I mentioned, my plan was to go out of town. And I just feel like that's not going to go as planned. So I'm going to end up most likely going out, just enjoying myself, doing whatever the fuck I want to do at that moment. Okay, y'all, so I am dressed. Um, I didn't really do my hair. I kind of just threw a couple curls in it. Something quick. Jean jacket, this little top. Um, it says fast and furious. Or fast because I'm furious. Something like that. Then I'm wearing this pair of jacket pants with these little fur slides. I'm finna go to... Bro, this hair is irritating me. I probably should have curled all of it instead of just a couple pieces. But this is the look for the day. Quick, simple. Very much so simple. I'm finna go to Forming Mills first. Well, y'all, first I'm going to the graveyard and then I'm going to Forming Mills and then Dollar Tree. And then I'm gonna see what time it is around that time. Then I might go to my dad's house or I might come back here, clean up and stuff, and then go back out. I don't know. We will see whatever I do do. It's like this one song that wanna let me be great, but it was just so cute before I curled it. That's what made me wanna curl it to make it cuter, but now I don't know. Not only that, it looks nice outside, so I feel like I shouldn't even put this jean jacket on. So, y'all, I am in the car. I am leaving the graveyard on my way to Foreman Mills. I wasn't going to Fairy Dollar and get the bathroom set, but mama said Foreman Mills most likely will have something more my taste. So, I'm going to go there and get something. But my limit for my bathroom set is really like probably $25, $30, honestly, truthfully. Then, I'm going to go to Dollar Tree after that. Grab a couple things, poster boards, some Q-tips, you know, stuff like that. Girl wipes, cinnamon wipes. Not only that, I was thinking, like, okay, even if I was still to go out of town and say, fuck it, and just go by myself. By me waiting last minute to book, the Airbnb is actually more, if that makes sense. What the fuck is they doing? Like, ugh, I hate people, bro. So, y'all, I guess it was a white car next to me, and they kept trying to slow down at the same pace that I was slowing down. So, I'm thinking, like, if they trying to watch me before... All the time, it was some dude in a car with his daughter trying to talk to me. Like, bro, no. Like, dude, you got your whole kid in the car. But, I don't know. People be crazy. People be crazy. Like, that just made me so uncomfortable at that. Okay, so I remember what I was saying. What I was saying was, I looked at my Airbnb, and my Airbnb came out to seven eight hundred. And that's damn near my rent. So it really would make sense to spend that on a five, six day trip and I could pay my rent for a whole month. And that's what mama was telling me. She was telling me like, you know, think of your priorities first. And that's honestly true. That's honestly true, but it's my birthday and I didn't plan to be paying a whole, you know, Airbnb fee by myself, as I mentioned. It's supposed to be two of us going, but I don't know y'all. I'm just thinking honestly, truthfully, because that is a big thing to think about if I want to go spend all this money when I could just be saving, paying rent, and then fuck around buy a car as well. So, I don't know. I'm thinking to give myself a new car for my birthday. That's really what I'm thinking. You must be made for me. Patience is everything. In and out, in and out, in and out. Arguing, trifling, difficult. Back more, I don't know why you I'm so glad that I can't 
bathroom set as y'all seen i decided to get um purple and like it's purple and like light pink something of that sort but i wanted to keep it like girly type shit so i did get that put around the dollar tree and get some more stuff that i need y'all the wind blowing today i don't want to different um dollar tree because that one didn't have shit literally nothing like for fuck going on is it a drought is it a drought please let me know so y'all i'm about to show y'all the stuff that i did get from dollar tree i went to like two three different dollar trees and i went to family dollar and then I also went to Foreman Mills. I did get some of these from Dollar Tree. I also got some batteries because I want to hang up my lights that I said I was going to hang up in my room. So I definitely want to put those together. So I did get some batteries. I also got some dish soap. I usually get the blue one, but I decided to get this one just to try something different. Then I got these cooling wipes. They are, they are basically body wipes. You can literally wipe whatever you want, whatever you need. Also got this. I was looking for some fucking. I was looking for some mouthwash, but Dollar Tree did not have no mouthwash. It was all sold out. So I ended up getting this Colgate Two in One mouthwash and toothpaste, ice blast whitening. I want to try it out and see what it gives. So I did get a little one. I got this Glade. I really don't know how it smells. I should have did it in the store. Okay, that's not bad. I got some soap so that I could wash my clothes Sunday. These because y'all, as y'all see in the video, I went to two or three different Dollar Trees and the whole rack for these were gone. Like, I don't know if it's some dried on these. I don't know what the fuck going on. So I ended up getting these. These are a little different from the normal ones. They got like that on there. I also got some silverware, bowls. So y'all, this is the bathroom set that I got. This is actually a Walmart one. I don't know what the fuck it was doing at Forming Mills. But I did get this. It was fifteen dollars. I told y'all my limit was twenty five, but this is fifteen. Definitely came in clutch. And since it was fifteen, I did get a couple more bathroom supplies to make it more of a look. I'm kind of over the pink thing, and it also still have some pink in it, if you can't see. Also got this for the bathtub to put inside. The one I got now is pink. I will show y'all before and after my bathroom because I'm gonna get it together now. But this was six dollars. And I also got a purple towel to put on my um, little white rolling caddy. Just not only that, y'all. If y'all got a corner news in y'all city, go check them out if y'all already have it. They got dry towels. Dry towels, three for 12. So definitely comes in clutch and they are good quality. The last thing I got is this wall decker for my bathroom. 
it says soap it is purple couple glitter pieces on it i'm gonna hang this up either over my toilet or on my wall the opposite way one or the other and it was only three dollars as y'all can see so i did get this the first dollar tree i ended up getting this poster board i was gonna get the soft one but i do not have my kitchen table yet so i don't have nothing to write on so i decided to get the harder one now I'm going to show y'all what I'm doing with this board later tonight when I come back in. I should have got more than one because I am having a girls night and I'm finna do drunk games. I don't know why I just didn't do that and get... I don't know why I didn't just do that and kill two birds with one stone. Because I know I'm finna have to go back to Dollar Tree this weekend. I also got some Pons Perfect Color Complex. It is basically for anti-marks. Skin. it was a dollar so i figured why not get it Pons has been doing good for my skin now I'm just trying to work on these bags honestly then i also got some markers they are scented i got this little caddy thing i was looking for the color purple but they did not have nothing like we need some whole new dollar trees at this point point. and last but not least i got a mop bucket because my last mop bucket ended up getting melted because i left the fucking water in there too long so that is literally everything that I got. And my total was probably like $60, $70 for all this stuff. So I feel like that's kind of good. Okay, y'all, so this is how my bathroom look. I'm giving y'all a real raw uncut, no filter. I need to clean all this stuff. I need to clean my tub out. I need to wash all this stuff. Just give it a whole new cleaning. Now, I forgot all about these tiles, honestly, truthfully, so I think I'm going to wash them. Stack them up differently, or I'm going to wash them, and then just put them up, one or the other. I don't know. I'm going to see once I finish putting the bathroom together and see how it looks. I need to throw this stuff in the garbage because this is empty. It's like at its last couple drops. And this is what the bathroom sink is looking like. I'll be moving everything right here because I do my hair in the bathroom, so I'll be having all my hair stuff around it. So, yeah. I'm gonna get this a whole 360, whole 360, whole 360. <laughs>
Okay, y'all, so I did finish with the board. This is how it looks. I was going to get real decorative with it and do, like, little pictures up in here. But I think I'm not. I think I'm just going to leave it just like this because I don't want to fuck it up or get to doing extra. But I got 22 things on my list for my summer 23, things that I want to do, knock down, just little fun things to make my summer a little more interesting and better. Most of this stuff on this list is mostly stuff that I can do by myself. We got bonfire, spa day, boat ride, 100k subs, drunk bowling because I've never been actual drunk bowling. Picnic day, 15k saved, beach day, take a trip slash vacation, Mall of America, Pain and Sip, Movie Marathon, Hot Girl Summer Night. When girl summer night, when I say Hot Girl Summer Night, I mean one of those nights where you like, we had a time last night, okay? Jet ski, ATV riding, pull up in a trench coat plus boots. I know y'all probably like, girl, what the hell? But if you know, you know, I always want to pull up in some lingerie in a trench coat and see what it gives. Then I got network slash meet and greet. I'm thinking about doing a meet and greet somewhere. If not, then most likely go to like a YouTuber function, something that's big to where I can get more you know, opportunities and network collabs, stuff like that. Then up here, we got carnival slash fair tattoo day because I am so ready for a sleeve. 24 hour challenge, which means stay up for a whole day, whole 24 hours. Start a photo book, thrift shopping. And the last thing is homemade pizza. Believe it or not, I am 21 years old, going to be 22, and I never made homemade pizza. So I'm definitely going to try that. This is what my list is looking like. I'm going to hang this up in my room or in my hallway, one or the other. Or I might put it in my beauty room. I'm not sure. But this is what my summer bucket list board is looking like. And y'all, this is very affordable. I paid $2.50 for the markers and the board. So definitely go get you one, sis. So girls and guys, guys and girls. I'm finna go ahead and rub me up a nighttime blunt. Well, a bedtime blunt and then get in the shower. Then get out and smoke. I literally did. Hold on. I literally did everything that I needed to do today. Literally everything. I made my board. I got my bathroom together. I went to the graveyard and I went and picked up my birthday money from my dad. So it's currently like I think it's like ten o'clock if I'm not mistaken. I'm currently watching um Meek vlog from Jamaica. I'm finna finish it and then get in the shower and then smoke. Call it a night. I think I'm going to close out this vlog here and start a new one tomorrow because I'm trying to be more consistent with y'all. Not only that, I do have time to be by myself, so might as well get more content in and vlog as much as I can. I figure why not give y'all footage and content while I'm in good spirits, shit like that. Also, tonight while I'm chilling, I'm going to order my table. I know y'all probably tired of me saying, like, where are you supposed to be ordered your table? I'm going to order my table tonight, and then it should be here by... Monday next week is basically my birthday. Well, not really because my birthday is on Sunday, but you know, next week is my week to start getting ready. I gotta go get my tattoo, gotta go get my nails done, hair done, lashes, feet done, wax, all that type of stuff. So that will be coming up soon. Not only that, y'all, I was reading my comments and somebody commented and said my boyfriend must have bought our tickets. Like, no, he did not pay for our tickets, he paid for his own ticket, and I paid for my own ticket. We was going half and half, 50 50. And that's why I was saying earlier, like, it didn't make sense for me to spend damn near 800 on the Airbnb because I didn't wait last minute, but spend 800 on Airbnb and I could pay that for my rent. You know what I'm saying? And actually plan out a trip and have it more planned out with more people, like a girl's trip. I should have did a girl's trip from the beginning, but I figured people was going to pull the same type of shit. But yeah, I'm going to close out this vlog here. I hope y'all enjoy as much as I enjoy putting it together. Everything will be in the description box below to my TikTok and my Instagram. Definitely go follow me if you haven't watched the rest of my videos. And sis, what are you doing? I don't know. But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We're almost at 1K. By the time I post this video, we might be at 1K. Y'all know the vibes. Until next time, I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.